personally one of my favorite things is that she has a warm smile on her face. She greets us every morning and it's just it's just fun to be in her class. I believe Miss Anderson should be the teacher of the year because she cares for her students and she wants them to go better and I feel like she is especially excited for the end of the year just to see where we have grown from the beginning. If you're stuck on a problem, she'll like help you define the words. She'll tell you what the problem means in other words than what it says because sometimes they're in really high level vocabulary that we don't understand. She always has her lessons prepared and she has the activities she's going to do well planned out and that she has like relationships with each student. She's really funny and she finds different ways to interact with the students. Motivating kids to succeed is probably the biggest part of our job. To me, building those relationships is the most important. Letting kids know that I care about them because I truly believe if they believe I care about them, then they're gonna care about what I'm teaching them. Overall, she just deserves it. She's such a great teacher and she's one of my best ELA teachers I've ever had in the past. Well, I just feel like I really came out learning something when I go to her class. I walk out knowing something I didn't know before. Mrs. Anderson inspires me in ways uh, like in the middle of the lesson she'll elaborate on something, like if we're talking about colleges, she'll elaborate on a college that uh, either her or her husband went to or something that's really cool about that college or something that we could major in later on to think of as a career. And uh, it inspires me, like, oh wow, that's really cool. She knows that, she's willing to share that. And she'll talk about life experiences she's had and it gets me thinking, like things that I can do. So I love what I do. I've wanted to be a teacher my entire life. I, I have a passion for education, a passion for my students. If she would win, that I'm pretty sure would mean the world to her. She's a great teacher. She knows what she's teaching. She knows what's going on around school and she knows what's happening. She's just nice and humble. I don't want to teach them what to think. I want to teach them to think so that they can take all of the information that they're going to learn in their lives and all of their experiences and be able to be the, pe the people that they want to be. All of her assignments and teaching isn't so serious. She adds humor into it, which makes the class enjoy it more and look forward to her class more. Like even, she knows that we're kids and we always make jokes and stuff. She doesn't put the rock down hard. She's nice, humble, and she's funny, especially. The best part about my job is working with the kids. Every single day, they're just such a joy. They really are. And the, the way that they love to learn and the light bulbs that you see and the smiles and the energy when they start to really understand what it is that we're working with and they make connections. She just gives everyone a chance and She's just super fun and funny. Oh, and she's an amazing drawler. Not really. Don't tell her I said that. Their why, why everything good happens. And that's, the, that's why we, do what we all do what we do. I just thank them for every day. I thank them for everything we do. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I used to not really know what I wanted to be when I grew up. But now I know that I want to be a teacher because of Miss Blaze. I think he's such a great teacher because um, he has a lot of patience for students. He always helps out his students. He brings, uh, he brings their self-esteem up instead of down. About five years ago, I was working at the high school and at the middle school. And when um, we hired another music teacher, I got to choose. Did I want to go to the high school or the middle school? I chose to come here. The best part about Mr. Howard's class is probably a bunch of people just trying to come together and just have fun and play music. The best thing about being in Mr. Howard's class is how joyful he is about music and how I realize it, it helps me in other classes too, even though it's fun. Motivation is a funny thing because it comes from you. If you're motivated, they come along with you. Mr. Howard makes jokes all the time. Even in the middle of the, serious so the most serious song, he'll stop and he'll make a joke about it. My wife wants me to retire and I'm thinking to myself, why do I want to retire? This is, this is fun. 
to come and work with them. That's the biggest reason I do this. He'll give us critical information about our how we can work on things, but it's not it's not hurtful and it just it seems very lighthearted. He lets you do some things a little outside the box. He doesn't keep you down. He encourages you to do better. My dad told me that if you find something you like to do, it's not like work. I love to come and work with students and be able to help them learn a piece of music. And I get paid, that's a bonus.